Continuing our celebration of 30 years of Warcraft, we're going to take Warcraft 2 and also make it widescreen. Take a look at this. Now, something you might notice at the far edges, we still have some pillar boxing going on. And this is because this resolution that we're looking at right now is actually 832 by 480, which is a 15.6 by 9 aspect ratio. 854 by 480 would be true 16 by 9. The reason for this is Warcraft 2 is actually, it requires the game to be drawn in blocks of 32. And as a result, we can't quite make a perfect 480p 16x9 resolution. We can get pretty close. There's one other resolution that I'll show you, but this is being accomplished here via the Warcraft 2 widescreen patch. So this is in the actual original Warcraft 2 engine itself, um, rather than like with Warcraft Orcs and Humans, I showed you War 1 Gus. I'll go ahead and show you War Gus as well, which is another way to do widescreen Warcraft 2. And actually is able to support the true 16x9 480p. Uh, but I'll show you a couple other resolution options we have available, including a true 16x9 widescreen Warcraft 2 original engine format. Let's take a look. After downloading the Warcraft 2 widescreen patch, what I personally did was make a copy of my good old games copy of Warcraft 2. Right within the good old games galaxy games folder, I just copied and pasted the entire Warcraft 2 Battlenet Edition folder. I then unzipped the Warcraft 2 widescreen patch into this new folder, which I labeled as wide, and had it replace any of the existing files whenever Windows prompted me to either skip or replace same named files. Now, I'm a bit hesitant to actually post a direct link to the widescreen patch itself because another Warcraft 2 YouTuber, Danny LDD, recently had his entire channel deleted by YouTube due to posting links to a mod site. They basically implied that he was violating the YouTube terms and conditions by sharing what they called hacking content. Obviously, that's not the case. I will post a link to my Discord, though, below. Also, if you search for the Warcraft 2 widescreen patch on your preferred search browser of choice, you should be able to find it rather easily. But you can also ask me directly in my Discord if you need additional help from there. Here, it comes with some pre-built options for resolution. This is under a file. Uh, it's one of the new files that the zip will include, which is the Warcraft 2 HD config. It's an application file. And these are some of the preset resolutions you can select. Warcraft 2's native resolution is 640 by 480, and the resolution I showed you at the beginning of this video was the 832 by 480 resolution. I found most of the people running the HD patch are running it in the ninth or the widescreen patch rather, also, sometimes you'll see it referred to as the HD patch. I'm running it in 960 by 544. There's also another file in here that's just called warcraft2hd.ini. And this file allows you to set a custom resolution. So we're actually going to go ahead and enter 1024 by 576. So back to that 32 by 32 block limitation of the Warcraft 2 engine, this is the first true 16 by 9 resolution that Warcraft 2 is capable of uh, demonstrating for you. I'm going to go ahead and save this file with that entered, and we're going to go ahead and take a look back at Warcraft 2. So here's what Warcraft 2 looks like when running the widescreen patch at a higher resolution than the native resolution. And as you can see, it actually, we have a black border around the menu screens. And this is because this remains in the original 640 by 480 at all times. And this includes if we start a campaign mission, you'll see that these screens are all also going to be within the borders. It's actually called Due window boxing as when there's the, the black, defense you know, borders around Lord. all sides. However, once we get into the game itself, the game fills up the yes, entire yes. screen. This is at that 1024 by 576 Your resolution. Yes, and in yes, this way, yes. we're actually able to play at Warcraft 2 in full 16 by 9 widescreen in the original game engine itself. 
This also works in the various yes, Battle.net servers yes. that are still online, whether it's the good old game server or the Warcraft 2 USA or Warcraft 2 RU servers. You can go in and play Warcraft 2 in 16x9, as well as the full campaign of the game and experience everything. Uh, original engine, original controls, original graphics, just with a broadened display area. One thing yes, that this has actually gotten me thinking about as well is in regards to real-time strategy uh, user interface designs is whenever most real-time strategies have the user interface area command cards and stuff at the bottom, Blizzard started doing this with StarCraft. With a widescreen display though, it actually is nice having it over to the side since in real-time strategy, you know, a battle is just as likely to happen up and down as it is side to side. And this way, the original Warcraft 2 actually has a direct one-to-one. -one. It's a box uh, viewing area, yeah. same with Warcraft 1. But with StarCraft yeah, 1, Star Warcraft 3, StarCraft yeah, 2, when you play those games As in widescreen, you you're actually viewing it in a very ultra-wide type view, which isn't necessarily ideal for RTS. So, just a thought there. I'm also going to go ahead and show another way to play Warcraft 2 in widescreen, which is with the Wargus mod. So we'll take a look at Wargus next. So here is Wargus, and a nice part about Wargus is it's able to display widescreen Warcraft 2 with stretched menus. Likewise, if we go in and start a campaign game, the initial, well, one thing, there are actually multiple difficulty levels accessible. This is a full Warcraft 2 mod. And these screens are all stretched out into widescreen. The intro the mi uh, missions are all, you know, stretched out, displaying the full thing. And another thing, here we are in the 854 by 480 true 16 by 9 480p. So Wargus, unlike the Warcraft 2 engine, Wargus is in the Stratagus engine and is not limited by the 32 by 32. Uh, block yeah. limitation that the original Warcraft 2 engine actually has. So, there's some updates. You can select more than nine yeah. units at a time yeah. if you'd like. There are also various shaders available that you can apply onto the game. Um, as if you saw my Warcraft 1 in widescreen, um, you know, my Warcraft 1 in widescreen video that I posted, you're able to see all of those as well. Um, also, a lot of different options as far as what the what the selections look like. Like here you can set it back to the original uh, Warcraft 2 boxes, so on and so forth. A lot of great options in there. Um, one of the options is also to change it. We might only be able to do it from the main menu, but you can change the number of, um, the number of units that you're selecting at a time as well. And then if we go back to the menu page, there are numerous video options, so we can do true, you know, 960 by 540. Um, you can also go into the files and edit the resolutions as well. There's 1280 by 720. Whenever you, by default, install Wargus, 1280 by 720 is actually the first true 16 by 9 resolution in there. You have to go into documents, Stratagus, Wargus, uh, scripts, options, and change the uh, options file to include these additional resolutions. Uh, and you can put in really any resolution that you'd like to see. And it very quickly updates it right there. As you can see, we can go back into that same mission. And as you can see, we have that zoomed out view in the Wargus engine, which is quite Your nice. And I think that this is a great way to Your be able to go orders? in and play Warcraft 2, especially if you prefer having Absolutely. some updated control options and things of that nature at your disposal. So next, I'm going to go ahead and show you a couple of the different widescreen resolutions, what they look like, and I'd like for you to comment in the comments below what your preferred viewing resolution and way of playing this might be. Here we have the 832 by 480 widescreen patch, approximate 16 by 9. This is the 960 by 544 widescreen patch, HD edition, we'll call it, slightly zoomed out. And the true 16 by 9 widescreen patch, 1024 by 576 resolution. And now for Wargus. True 16 by 9, 854 by 480 within the Wargus 
mod of Warcraft 2, which is in the Stratagus engine. 960 by 540 Wargus, again, true 16x9 here. And then the default 16x9 that's within Wargus of 1280 by 720 You'll notice there is quite a bit of UI def deformation, especially on the uh, left-hand column there. Um, I also, in my opinion, this is a little bit too zoomed out, but it is an option that is available. So again, please let me know in the comments below what resolution you prefer and what you plan on doing first while playing Warcraft 2 in widescreen. I'm Mick. This is MickCraft. Thank you for joining me. I hope you found this helpful, and I look forward to catching you in my next video.